There's a cucumber in my water. Uh huh. Do they know it's there? I'm, should I tell somebody? It's there on purpose. It's refreshing. Interesting. The world's most boring liquid and the world's most boring vegetable. You put them together and bam. Hey. Oh, good, you're here. Are you still fighting? If you get divorced, do I get two Christmases? We're not getting divorced. Listen, we realized that uh, we're facing some new challenges as a married couple. Yeah, and there are a few things we need to stay on top of. So we thought it would be useful. I can't believe I am about to say this. Um... Would you please help us make a relationship agreement? <laughs> but one that's tailored to us, okay? We don't need a bathroom schedule. Although a rule about him texting me from in there might help with the romance. <laughs> what do you say? I get to write a contract? I say, let's get this party of the first part started. <laughs> That's funny. It's in our agreement. I have to laugh. <laughs> is draft acceptable? Then I believe your new relationship agreement is ready to be signed. Article 8, subsection B. Leonard will restrict video gaming in underpants to hours Penny is not home. This includes boxers, briefs, thongs, G-strings, or anything else that calls attention to his pasty little thighs. <laughs> Do I really need to say that? I did this for free. Let me get a little something. <laughs> Article 10, subsection C. If questioned, Penny may not say that everything is fine if it isn't. Other unacceptable responses include, it's nothing, don't worry about it, and I said it's nothing, don't worry about it. I think this all looks good. Me too. Oh, well, great then. Here, you sign here, date here, and Penny, if you could initial here to indicate that you're accepting Leonard in as-is condition. <laughs> I remember signing our first relationship agreement. You seem to be forgetting the no nostalgia clause. Right, right, got it. 